Do you speak English? That customer needs large size shoes in this model. I've checked in the storeroom. We don't have stock. All right, I will convey. Jenny, would you like to grab a cup of coffee? Yes, there is new coffee shop opens next to our store. What happened Jenny? You look happy. Something special happened recently. Yes. I got engaged last week. Really? No way. Can't believe that. Anyway, congratulations. Thanks. Yes, the entire process was fun. I'm so happy for you. So how did he opens up? I always knew Tony was the one. Our common friend Jack threw a party. He took me to that candlelight dinner. He surprised me over dinner. Tony suddenly held my hand and said, "Will you marry me?" And then he got on his knees and showed me a beautiful ring. That's so interesting. Hope you enjoyed the special moment. Were there a lot of people around you? Yeah. Our college mates and Jack relatives around us. But we didn't care about that. Everyone applauded when we were hugging after I said yes. It's time to get planning for the big day. When is that? We set the date for 14th February. It's good to holding the party on a weekend. We decided to do a midday pool party. We don't want to be costly. I prefer to hold just a small get together. But Tony prefers to hold an evening filled with dancing and music. I'm on a tight budget. So, I reduce the guest list by inviting only family members and close friends. An important factor is the party venue must have parking facility. Ample parking space is available that's not an issue. I'm planning to keep the decorations simple such as streamers and balloons. But Tony wants photo boards of us. That's a great theme. How about the menu plan? Be careful of any allergies. I would like to order truffle cake. He wants to put a picture of the proposal on the cake.
Wow! That's amazing! Alternatives we can include ice cream sandwiches, assorted baked goods. He wants to arrange party games and DJ. People might like to dance. Of course. He's right. Make sure you have energy and are not too stressed to have fun during the party. We're planning to take lots of photos so that we can choose best one for album. An engagement party should be a happy and fun celebration. Of course. That's a big day in your life. Thank you for your ideas and suggestions. That's my pleasure. You're remembering my daughter's wedding. So sweet of you. Excuse me. Do you mind if I sit here? Not at all. Go ahead. All are welcome on Washington State Ferries. Do they check bags on ferries? No, there is no check-in procedure for luggage items. First time traveling by ferry? Yes, I'm super exciting. A ferry travel is an awesome experience. Boarding starts at around 8 a.m. Excuse me, would you mind if I sit here? Not at all. Are you Jenny? Yeah, have we met before? What a surprise. It's me, John. We were classmates in high school. John, fancy meeting you here. It's been five years since I last saw you. Sorry, I did not recognize you because I haven't seen you in a long time. Why would you say that? Has my appearance changed that much? During high school, I had saggy skin on my jawline. Also had bad acne all over my face. I hated that, my friends used to tease me a lot. I tried so many remedies to prevent acne but it's not worked for me. Finally, my friend recommends a dermatologist, I recovered from acne problem. Don't be so hard on yourself. Acne is a common teenage problem. Nothing to worry about that. I was skinny, I started workout to tone my muscles. I changed my lifestyle like healthy eating and regular physical activity. Now it become part of my daily routine.
But you haven't changed a bit since high school. You look the same. Really? We had fun time in high school. I didn't get chance to meet you at our 10-year high school reunion. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to make it to the reunion. It's so nice that you could catch up with all our classmates. Yeah, actually I have kept in touch with some of them over the years. Did you hear that Monica become a doctor in Washington University? I remember her, she used to study all the time. And did you know that Tony got married with Jennifer? It is no wonder, they had been in love with each other since high school. Lucky. Do they have any children? As far as I know, that is not true. I met Ryan in embarrassing situation, he working as a servant due to financial crisis. My friend Sarah working as a HR, she is looking for an assistant, so I recommend him. I appreciate your help. Do you still live in San Francisco? No, I moved to Seattle eight years ago. What about you? So, what have you been up to these past 10 years? Well, I got a degree in marketing. I met my husband, Williams, through online dating. After we met, it was a whirlwind romance. We have two kids, small and happy family. That great to hear. And where do you work? I started working at a reputed company as a customer support. But all along I knew sales was not a right choice for me. So, I finally made up my mind to go for it, I quit my job. I'm more passionate about social media. Started doing producers videos from home. I wanted to be a YouTuber. Then I rented a place and set up an office. My company grown up in few years. You rock. I'm really happy for you. I think it takes lots of guts to start such a business. It has been a lot of work, but it's been worth it. How about you? What have you been up to all these years? Well, I studied electrical and got my degree in engineering. But my passion was making films. I got an opportunity to work as an assistant director. I couldn't earn a living from the assistant director job. That sounds tough. I had to work all kinds of work to meet my needs for beginning of my career. I did modern paintings. Also, I did some delivery job. 
I want to be successful in films, but I don't know if it's going to be successful. Just hang in there. Sometimes the road to success is not easy. Hard work and patience always pay off big time. Just keep going and hopefully you'll make it. Even if that doesn't happen, I can live with that. It's not the end of life. Life is a roller coaster, have ups and downs. That's life. How about your family? I'm a happy married man with two beautiful kids. Time has flown by. I'm glad to hear that. You are invited to the birthday party of my sweet little daughter who is turning one on coming Sunday. See you soon. Do you speak English?